What are the implications of giving up a green card if you've had one for a few years and you've been a permanent resident and you've decided I want to go back to my home country or go somewhere else and give up my uh, permanent residency in the US? So having a green card for a few years isn't an issue. You can just file, you know, the I-407 with an immigration lawyer and then do your final tax return. Not a problem. But if you've held a green card for eight years, then you become what's called a covered expatriate which puts you in scope of a potential exit tax that the IRS may want to levy for you to exit the US tax system. So it would be good to avoid that if you can. So proper planning is essential to make sure you never even have to worry about an exit tax. Awesome. So if eight years, if you've had a residency for, uh, sorry, permanent resident card for eight or more years, and you're thinking about going, you should first speak to someone like yourself, an accountant, that can make sure you've prepared for what might come in way of exit tax leaving the US? Yes, and definitely don't leave it to the last minute because I have seen situations where it's they've held it for six years, but they also held it for two days. One of those days was on different calendar years, and so the IRS said, oh, it's eight years. Wow, okay, good to know. So prepare, prepare. If you're gonna get a green card, know it from the outset what the plan is and what the exit uh, strategies are if in the future you might wanna leave. Exactly, if you're not planning on becoming a US citizen. Got it.